Good morning, Junior One. Today we are uh, going to review something. Okay, let's start. Complete the following. Number one, five pounds and two ten pounds moved. Okay, we have five pounds and two ten pounds. Okay, we have to move each one. Okay, so we have five, ten, and ten. Five plus ten plus ten equal ten plus ten count by tens. Ten, twenty. We have twenty plus five. Okay, stand on twenty by using one hundred and twenty charts. Stand on twenty and go. Forward the five steps. One, two, three, four, five. The number will be twenty-five. Okay. Number two, the number of the weeks, days. How many days of the week? Yes, we have seven days of the week. Number three, four units and one ten. Okay, four units. And one ten. We have two place value units and tens. Four units. So put four here. And one ten. That's meaning one in the tens. The number will be fourteen. Okay. Number four. Twenty three equal three plus what? Three in the units and two in the tens. Okay. The value of three is three, and the value of two is what? Good job. The value of two is twenty. Why? Because two in the tens. Okay. Number five. Dots equal five plus thirty. Can you guess the number? What? The number equal five plus thirty. Good job. Thirty five. Five in the tens, and the value of the three is thirty because three in the tens. Number six. The number of the colors of the flag of Egypt. Here we have the flag of Egypt. The color of this red, white. And black. So, how many colors? Good job. We have three colors. Number seven. Fifty-five equal what plus what equal what? Fifty-five. Five. five uh, let's start with uh, write the number in the digit. Fifty-five. That's meaning fifty. Five, okay, and I have five in the units, so the value of the five is just five. And I have five in the tens, so the value of this is fifty. Okay, number eight, the greatest two-digit number. I want the greatest two-digit number by using one hundred and twenty chart. Look here. What the greatest two digit number I have? The greatest number is ninety nine. Number nine, the greatest number of two different digits. I want the greatest number, but two different digits. Okay. Here we have the two digit number. It's ninety nine. Okay, so I choose ninety nine. But I want two different digits. Okay, so choose ninety eight. Okay, number ten, the smallest two digit number. Look here. I want the smallest two digit number. Okay, the smallest two-digit number is ten. Good job. Number 
11 the smallest number of two different digits okay i want the smallest number of two different digits it's also 10 because 10 has different digits number 12 the number of the year's month how many months of the year i have 12 months of the year good job number 13 71 in digits right 71 in digits so 71 number 14 32 in letter 32 30 Two. Oh. Number 15, the day which comes directly before Sunday is. Before Sunday. Before Sunday is what? Okay, before Sunday, Saturday. Number 16, the day which comes directly after Wednesday is after Wednesday what? Good job. After Wednesday is Thursday. Number 17. The number of pupils in your class is 24. Number 18. The greatest number formed from two digits and its unit is zero. Is this must its unit is zero. We have two digits, unit and tens. Okay? And in the units we have zero. I want the greatest number. Look here. Look here we have uh, its unit is zero. Which number is the greatest formed from two digits? Good job. Nine. So put nine. Number 19. The value of the digit seven in the numbers 72 is? I want the value of seven. The value of seven is 70. Why? Because 7 in the tens. Number 20. The value of the digit 7 in the number 27 is? Look here. 7 in the units. So the value of 7 is 7. Complete in the same pattern. 10, 20, 30. Okay. Count by tens. Look here. In the 120 chart, count by tens 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Put more than, less than, or equal. Number one, 67. 76. Okay? Look at the greatest place value. We have units and tens. Units, tens. Okay? In the tens, tens is the greatest place value. So, look at the tens here. We have six and here seven. Okay? So, six is less than seven. So, 67 is less than 76. Okay? Number 2, 75 and 86. Look at the tens. Okay? And 7 is less than 8. So, 75 is less than 86. Number 3, 75 and 70 plus 5. First, do that. 70 plus 5. Stand on 70 by using 120 charts. Stand on 70 
Last five. Go forward five steps. One, two, three, four, five. The number will be seventy-five. We have seventy-five and also seventy-five. So good. Good job. Equal. Number four. We have fourteen and four plus ten. By using one hundred and twenty charts, stand on ten and go four forward steps. One, two, three, four. The number will be fourteen. Okay, fourteen and also fourteen. So good, good job. Equal because fourteen is the same as fourteen. Number five. Seventy-nine minus fifty-three and twelve plus twelve. Let's do this by using one hundred and twenty charts. Seventy-nine minus fifty-three. Stand on seventy-nine. Okay. Minus fifty-three. We have five in the tens. So uh, go down five steps. One, two, three, four, five. The number will be twenty-nine. Okay, and in the fifty-three, we have three in the units. Go backwards three steps. One, two, three. The number will be twenty-six. Here, twelve plus twelve. By using double strategy. Okay, twelve plus twelve equal what? Good job, twenty-four. Here we have twenty six and twenty four. Twenty six is more than twenty four. Number six, forty eight minus thirty and forty nine plus thirty. Let's do this. Forty eight stand on forty eight minus thirty. We have three in the tens, so go down three steps. One, two, three. The number will be eighteen, and I have zero in the units, so still standing on eighteen. Forty-nine plus thirty. Stand on forty-nine plus thirty. I have three in the tens, so go up three steps. One, two, three. The number will be seventy-nine. And I have zero in the units, so still standing on seventy-nine. I have eighteen and seventy-nine. Look at the tens. I have eighteen and seventy-nine. Look at the tens. Here I have one, and here I have seven. One. Is more than or less than or equal seven? One is less than seven, so eighteen is less than seventy-nine. Number seven, ten plus fifth. Okay, the greatest number is fifth, so stand on fifth. Fifty plus ten. I have in the ten, one in the tens, so go one up. Okay, and I have zero in the units, so still standing on six. And because instead of by using one hundred and twenty charts, you can use uh, count by tens. Okay, fifty plus ten equal sixty. Here we have sixty and sixty, the same numbers, so both equal. Okay, number eight seventy one and. Fifty plus twenty. Stand on fifty. Fifty plus twenty. We have two in the tens. So go up two steps. One, two, and we have in the twenty zero in the tens. So still standing on. Uh, sorry, zero in the ones. So still standing on seven. Here we have seventy-one and seventy. 
Good job. 71 is more than 70. Number 9. 90 minus 20. Stand up. 90. 90 minus 20. In the 20 we have 2. In the 10. So go down. 2 steps. 1, 2. The number will be 7. Okay? And we have 0 in the units. So still standing on 7. 80 minus 10. Okay? Stand on 80. Okay? Minus 10. I have 1 in the 10. So go down 1 step. The number will be 70. And we have 0 in the units. So still standing on 70. Here we have 70 and also 70. Okay? 70 is the same as 70, so put equal. Number 10. 95 and 90 plus 5. Is it do that on 120 short? 90. Stand on 90 plus 5. So go forward 5 steps. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. The number will be 95. Here we have 95 and also 90, 95. So put more than or, or less than or equal. Good job. Equal. Number 11. 90 and 40 plus 50. The greatest number is 50. Okay? So stand on 50. 50 plus 40. We have 4 in the tenth. So go 4 steps up. 1, 2, 3, 4. And we have 0 in the units. So still standing on 9. Here we have 90 and also 90. So put equal. 